Right, sir. Lose no time. They must be distributed tonight. We'll be done, then. idea. Tom Wayne, the next time you see rifles, You'll be looking down the barrels of a firing squad. So you are, El Shaitan. Resisting arrest, eh? <laughs> You're coming to us and explain to the sergeant. We caught this man running away, sir. Major Booth, you're playing a very dangerous game, sir. And even though you are an American Secret Service man, I won't be responsible if one of my men should shoot you while you're wearing that disguise. That's a risk I've got to take, Colonel. My orders are to deliver Wayne to the American Embassy at Paris for trial. And I'm going to do it. I told you before that I'm going to court-martial Wayne for the murder of our man Corday. Then, if he doesn't face the firing squad, you're welcome to him. Now, isn't it a fact, Miss Corday, that when you ran into your brother's room on the day he was murdered, you saw the prisoner with a gun in his hand trying to get away? But I tell you, that my brother left a letter that cleared Lieutenant Wayne of all these charges. Gun running and murder. Why, they were the best of friends. There's no reason why he should have hurt Almond. You can see that. But this letter you speak of, we have no concrete evidence that it ever existed. We have only your word. It was stolen from me by a band of Arabs. If you'll give me time enough, I'm sure I can get it back. Unless this letter is produced immediately, I'm afraid Miss Corday's testimony is of no value. That's all, Miss Corday. How's it going, Miss? I don't know. Colonel Duval seems so prejudiced against him. Lieutenant Wayne, you've been found guilty of murder. It is the verdict of this court that you be executed by a firing squad within 24 hours. Oh, Tom, did they? Yes, 24 hours. Don't worry, miss. We'll do something. They can't get away with this. Oh, what can you do? There's only one man who can help me now. Who's that? El Cudor. I'm going to him at once. I don't trust that guy El Cudor any more than I trust Gavar. Come on! Must be 
the open door at once. Admit the young lady, Salem. Welcome, Elaine. I need your help, Elkador. It's a matter of life and death. Well, what has happened, my child? Lieutenant Wayne has been sentenced to be shot. Only Almond's letter can save him. What can I do? You can get the letter back from your friend, Del Magrib. Oh, I know it was he that kidnapped me and took the letter. I could have told that at the trial. But I kept silent to protect you. How can I refuse to help such a true friend as you have shown yourself to be? Here is the letter. I was holding it for purposes of my own. Oh, thank you, El Cador. I shall not forget. Wise to come here now? I had to come. El Satan knows I took the letter from the girl. I told him I had destroyed it. No one must know it still exists. But the letter is no longer in my hands. I've just given it to Elaine Corday. And you've signed my death warrant. Unless I can overtake her and... Give me that letter. Give it to me. Are you all right, miss? Never mind. He didn't call me and I need your help. Did you get the letter? Yes. But I don't trust Colonel Duval. And I must get to the commanding general at C.D. Bell Abbott. But you can't ride to C.D. Bell Abbott in 24 hours. I'm not going to ride. Oh! 
Somebody's stealing the Colonel's plane. Hey! It worked. <laughs> sure. And it was a lot of fun. <laughs> ah, but look what you've done to my sausage. This letter justifies a new trial for Lieutenant Wayne. I'll grant him a reprieve. Oh, thank you, General Foray. You've saved the life of an innocent man. A safe and successful journey to you, Miss Corday. detail to the firing squad. Wayne's our friend. We ain't gonna shoot him down. You know the penalty for refusing to obey orders. Get your rifles and fall in. That won't do our friend Wayne any good. Stop! Hey! Stop! Stop! I'm not going to you! Fire! 